Got about a two hour break right now. So I figured why not do a couple loops around the studio, get some steps in. I've uh, just naturally like going to lunch or drive locking or anytime I'm actually shooting, I have my phone on silent so I can get my steps in. And without even trying, I have like 4,500 almost today just from work in general. Um, but now I'm gonna do a couple loops and maybe do another three or 4,000, get some nice sun, some fresh air. So over here, you can see where the music's coming. Commissary's uh, right here. And then they've got like some workspaces over here, which I never really utilize. Um, see if anybody's even over here. No. There might be people over here though. Yeah, I don't want to disturb them, but yeah, inside here is the studio. Um, I'll show you once I walk around as well. <clears throat> so this is the Burbank Studios and it's right off of uh, Bob Hope. My script's falling out of my back pocket here. Um, it's off of Bob, Hope, Alameda, and Olive here for anyone who's familiar with Burbank. But even like over here, look at these mountains. They're beautiful because uh, we had a lot of rain here in LA recently. So all the mountains are green. There's so much more greenery. For a while, during all the droughts, it's all brown. But everything's green right now, looking beautiful. I think that's Sal Stowers. Heading to the commissary. Hey Sal, I don't know if this is stalkery or not, but I see you. But the key is to walk fast enough to get a good kind of workout in, but not fast enough where you're breaking too much of a sweat where I'm gonna get yelled at by makeup and hair if I need everything redone. At least I took off my wardrobe shirt. It's a light blue, so that wouldn't go well if I were perspirating. <clears throat> but this is good. There's some, uh, you'll have to ask or DM or comment or tweet Brian Dottillo and ask him about the speed bumps that were put in years ago in the studio. I think he was responsible 20 years ago and they got a couple speed bumps here. So ask him about it. He has a, a good story, but I think he's the culprit. So now I'm back inside. Leno, I remember he was here when I first started. Um, he always used to have his cars parked, like a new car every day. But that was, I think, my first four years on the show. Now, this is Studio One. We're in Studio Two and Four. And then this is pretty cool. Evolution of NBC. because I'm getting close to the studio. I've actually never been down this hallway before, but it's just a bunch of, a bunch of stuff here. So yeah, it's relatively like quiet. We got, I think there's another production going on here, but not too much. Um, but now I'm approaching, so I gotta, have a, like a little flash light outside it means that they're filming but someone's building something all right Hello, hello, everybody. So two things. First of all, I just want to say a very, very happy birthday to Joni and Justine, two absolutely fabulous, incredible ladies that I'm blessed to know. So happy birthday. And secondly, I did not forget about these squats. Today is day five. I'm about to do 70 in a little bit. So the neighbors yesterday were amazing, uh, no noise, but at three o'clock in the morning, somebody was repairing their truck in the parking lot across the street. Um, apparently a hammer or loud banging fixed trucks because the truck was no longer there. Um, 
but it's probably been a week now that I've yet to have a full seven hour sleep straight without being woken up. But I'm positive, I'm optimistic, I'm excited. It is Friday, I've got my coffee. I didn't work today, so I was able to actually sleep in a little bit, which is great. Um, now I'm gonna go work out here in a bit and uh, get ready for the weekend and my birthday on Tuesday. <laughs> 